they are great if you use them you show your courage to the examiner that you are not just a mere speaker of english language but your language is really diversified if you can learn these words then my friend your english language is going to be very attractive so today i have collected two prefixes for you there are plenty of them like 50 to 60 prefixes but not anyone can digest all of these 50 to 60 prefixes in one go so two at a time because you know what it is better to learn two prefixes or three prefixes at a time rather than cramming all of them and not being able to use them when it is needed so it's better to learn bit by bit do you understand my point so remember what i told you before that they are great but if you use them so using them is a one point if you want to be like show your english language you need to practice on it so let's get started and learn these words so the first prefix word that we have is pre pre its meaning is earlier than or you can also say that prior to in advance and beforehand so we have several words related to pre for example pre arrange pre board pre paid pre mix and pre heat there are several other words that you can make so the first one was pre arrange and its meaning is to arrange something in advance so let's understand it in a sentence all games to be played according to pre arranged rules second word is pre board exam now what is the meaning of it it is an exam before board exams the sentence is 3 weeks later i too got the result of my pre board exam third one is pre paid the meaning is pay in advance now the sentence the shipping charges are pre paid now we have the word pre mix the meaning of it is to blend something blend means mix something right to blend something in advance now the sentence is the chainsaw chainsaw is kind of tool by which we can cut a wooden piece right the chainsaw runs on a pre mix of oil and gasoline the last word that we have is pre heat heat beforehand the sentence is preheat the oven to 200 degrees celsius now the prefix that we have is re the meaning of re is doing something again for example readjust its meaning is setting something or adjusting something again in the sentence i readjusted the rear view mirror the next one is rewrite like writing something again to improve it and in the sentence he is rewriting the rules of retailing third one is reread to read something again in a sentence i reread the poem rejoin like joining something or joining with someone again the sentence is she rejoined her friends in the lounge last one is reassemble like joining things or gathering things together again the sentence is 
the mechanic reassembled the engine. This is what the magic of root words with prefixes. So understand their meaning and use them with ease.